Okay, so this time we're going to be making clouds, aren't we? Yeah, yeah, yeah. we are. Alright, and now this time we need to simulate a high pressure environment and a low pressure environment. Yeah. What happens in high pressure? There's no clouds. No clouds, right. And what happens in really low pressure? There's clouds. Which happens because the evaporation's come up and it's condensated, hasn't it? Yeah. Yep. So the, and the low pressure helps that to happen, doesn't it? Because yeah. all the little particles stick together. Yeah. But we need, we still need warm water because we need water that's evaporating, don't we? Yeah. So we can get some water into our air because this yeah. is going to be our air, isn't it? Yeah. And then we need some more pollutants because we still need something for the for the water to hang on to, don't we? Yeah. Up in the air. And then we're going to use this pump. Yeah. Okay. With to, this valve on it to yeah. do what? To pump all the air in. And make it what? High pressure. High, high pressure. High pressure. Okay, cool. So here we go. We're going to put some water in here. Yeah. Okay. Just a little bit at the bottom, don't we? Yeah. Okay, and now what we're going to do is we're just going to move this around the bottle so that it gets into the air. Yeah. Okay? Yeah, we're going. And then we're going to put some pollutants in the air. Yeah. Okay. Pollutants, pollutants like, are matches like that. Like smoke and stuff, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. And then what we're going to do is we're going to seal the bottle up with this, aren't we? Yeah. Which has got our pump head in it. Yeah. Okay, now you can see the pollutants in the air this yeah. time because we've trapped them inside really tightly. Now hold on to that bottle. Yeah. Hold it nice and tight. And then we're going to pump the bottle up. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So it's very high pressure. So now you can feel it's really firm, isn't it? Lots yeah. of pressure inside the bottle. Okay, now watch this. Here we go. We're going to make clouds. Wow, look at that. We've made clouds, haven't we? Yeah. Because now all that high pressure in there got released, and then we have low pressure. So it's like when the synoptic charts change, isn't it? Yeah. And we get a high pressure system move through and a low pressure system comes in and then we have clouds. Yeah. How cool is that? So we can puff them and they come out. Okay, now wait. If we pump this back up again, watch what happens to the clouds. Yeah. So now we're in we're in, you know, it's come through, the synoptic charts have changed, there's a high pressure chart, high pressure systems come in. Hey, where have all our clouds gone? They're where have they gone? gone? They've gone because we don't have any more smoke. Oh no, but we pumped it up, so what's happened? Is the pressure higher? No. Yeah, look, it's all yeah. pumped up, so the pressure's higher, isn't it? Mm. Yeah, so what happens in a high pressure? They Clouds go... Away. They go away, don't they? But if it happens in low pressure, we get low pressure back. Yeah. Hey, we've got clouds again. Yeah. See, that's all happened because the pressure changes. Now, yeah. if there weren't any pollutants in the air, it would be harder to make clouds. Okay, but they would still... Look, more clouds. Woo! Good work, babe. You can pause that now, everyone.